I love it here. This place is like a second home to me. This place, Sarah Pottage calls her second home, is the Acton Youth Center that officially opened in October. And in the last month, Pottage says she spends most of her time after school here. I come here to do my homework. I come here to hang out with friends. I come here to get help with supports and there's free food. Well, free food sure can be tempting, but in all seriousness, though, Pottage says she finds the Acton Youth Center a welcoming sanctuary. The staff here, I consider them family. They help me so much through everything, everything I just mentioned, including more. And coming here is like fun for me and it makes me feel free in a way. It's, it's different from like just going to the park with your friends or something because you actually feel like you belong. And that sense of belonging is exactly what the town of Halton Hills was trying to achieve with this newly renovated space located here on Willow Street North. Recreation coordinator Jennifer Ancona says they offer a variety of programming and services to youth 12 to 14. So usually there is uh, rec recreation based programming, so arts, crafts, games, video game tournaments. Um, there will be sometimes a food component as well um, and we like to add an educational or social piece as well. So service providers come in and we'll do different presentations, um, topics that youth have picked that want more information. We also have uh, other supports, uh, mental health supports and addiction supports right on site. Um, so youth have accessed those services, um, they grab some to eat, hang out, and just really a safe, uh, welcoming space for them to socialize with their friends. The center was several years in the making. Director of Recreation Services Samantha Howard says it was a collaborative investment. So our local town council approved a uh, million dollar capital project for this for this building and further to that we then had um, contributors which are recognized around the center. So the service club collaborative of Halton Hills donated uh, $10,000 to sponsor our large community room. Uh, the Rotary Club of Acton in memory of former Rotarian Dave Maines uh, donated $5,000 for the small community room. The Saw Memorial Golf Tournament in memory of uh, Stephen Warby donated $5,000 towards a conversational pod and um, tech equipment. And most recently, the Three Musketeers uh, Golf Tournament donated n just over $9,400, which will outfit our outdoor spaces. Plus, we've had uh, a variety of contributions from local businesses and local community members in the form of food and gift cards and equipment, to name a few. Daily programming is promoted on the center's Instagram page at underscore HH Youth. And for those who still need some convincing on whether or not to give the Acton Youth Center a shot, well... Just do it. <laughs> this is the best place ever. I come here every day and yeah, I'll be your friend. <laughs> Reporting for Halton News in Acton, I'm Melissa Candelaria.